As senior prophet T.B. Joshua built the foundation of healing and deliverance in Christ Jesus for the generations to come and build their faiths on it, and one of his sons, senior evangelist Terence, has followed the footsteps of his father, senior prophet T.B. Joshua, watched the works of the Holy Spirit through his servant, senior evangelist Terence. As he preaches to the congregant the words of encouragement to strengthen their faith, as he believes that God does nothing without his word, for the healing and deliverance are the confirmation of the word of God. <laughs> the atmosphere is changing as we pray. The Spirit of the Lord is moving as we pray. Chains are breaking as we pray. God Himself is moving as we pray. The angels of the Lord are on assignment as we pray. The Spirit of the Lord is moving. As we pray, the swaking talakapa, the Holy Ghost is hovering everywhere, everywhere, everywhere. As we pray, as we pray, as we pray, oh, 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 senior evangelist Terence was moving through the midst of the congregation when he encountered a lady named Madame Mbong Marinette. She was experiencing difficulties in working due to a moving object in her leg. Watch what happened. Louder. After receiving spirit-filled prayers from God's servant, senior evangelist Terence, Madame Mbong lifted up her hands as a sign of gratitude to glorify Master Jesus Christ. While senior evangelist Terence was praying for the congregants during the January 21st, 2024 Sunday service, he encountered a violent mad lady who was brought to the solution ground with her hands tied up with chains due to her aggressive and violent behavior. Her father who brought her to the solution ground revealed that he was advised to put her in chains after she attempted to kill her two years old child with a knife by slitting his throat. And this made her a threat in her neighborhood as many parents fear for the life of their kids. Looking at the neck of the child, one could easily see scars confirming that the little boy narrowly escaped death. His father also revealed that she had tore a Bible that was given to her into pieces which made him wonder if God can restore her sanity. But after he heard about the marvelous things happening at the solution ground, he decided to take her case to God, believing that only Jesus has the final say over every situation. Let's watch how senior evangelist Terence used the oil of liberty to liberate her from the shackles of the spirit of madness with just a single spray. So the oil of liberty is anointed by Jesus to do works like this, to heal the sick, to deliver the demon possessed. In the days of old, aprons and handkerchiefs were anointed this it is still happening today in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I see clean upon you in the name of Jesus from the crown of your head to the of your feet in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Say thank you, Jesus. So you want to be the friend of Jesus? Yes, sir. Jesus loves you. Amen. 
By his stripes you were delivered. Amen. By his stripes you were blessed. Amen. I had to take it off by herself. You can help her now. Jesus Christ is the same yesterday and today and forever. He never said goodbye. He still performs miracles, like in the days of old, through his anointed servants and those who believe in his healing power shall receive his divine healing for the salvation of their souls. How are you? How are you? Say thank you, Jesus. Say thank you, Jesus. I am free. I am healed. I am delivered. I am blessed. Jesus Christ said in Matthew chapter 11, verse 28, Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. The congregants were carried away by excitement as they were surprised to witness the sanity of a violent mad girl restored back to normal with just few sprays of the oil of liberty. She was brought to the solution ground with her hands tied with chains and many of the congregants were even scared to come close to her even with her hands bound in chains. But after she received her freedom, she is now as harmless as a dove. Truly whom the sun sets free is free indeed. Glory be to our Lord Jesus Christ. She's free. Amen. 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 She's free. Amen. 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 Broken today. Amen. 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 Move Amen. 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 She has been set free from the spirit of madness. There's no situation Jesus Christ cannot change, and there's no problem Jesus Christ cannot solve. All you need is a touch from Jesus, and those demons that have kept you in captivity for so long will flee. What issue are you battling with? What is that issue that has kept you in chains for so long? Only Jesus Christ.